Hi, our lesson today is on metric system conversion um, using an acronym. A little bit faster, so when you're taking a test, you just write down these simple terms. Um, our acronym is KHD UDCM. So, how am I supposed to remember that? This is how you remember it. King Henry usually, King Henry doesn't usually drink chocolate milk, and that's how you can remember that. This is our old basic system of um, conversion. You got the kilo, hecto, deca, the unit, which is meter, grams, and liter, deci, centi, and milli. As you move to the left of the board, you get bigger. As you move to the right, you get smaller. And each step you take will start from the units. You get 10 times larger or 10 times smaller. So it's really, if you're in a time test, it's really hard to write down all this. So what I recommend is just write down KHD, UDCM, and then remember that it's King, Kilo, Henry, for Hecto, Dozen, Deca, usually for the unit measurement, Drink for Deci, Chocolate for Centi, and Milk for Millie. And we're going to do two problems on the board just to get you um, thinking that way. Okay, so we have kilo, hecto, deca, units, deci, centi, and milli. We're going to take 100 hectometers. And um, what I do is write 100 under the label hecto. And you always, the decimal point is very important. Either we're going to move left on the scale or right on the scale. And our next measurement, we want to see how many, 100 hectometers equals how many meters. So we're at hecto, and we want to go to meters, which is a unit. We're going one, two spots. So all we do is move that decimal point two spots. Get the decimal point there, and put your zeros in there. And our answer is 10,000. 10,000 meters. Now we're going to move to the left side of the board. We're going to go from 5.4 grams, which is right here. So all I do is write 5.4. And we see which way we have to move. Since we're going from grams to decagrams, that brings us to the left side, going left. So all we do is take that decimal point, which is really important, and since we're only going one spot, we'll go from one spot here, and we'll end up with 0.54 decagrams. So as you, as you see, as you're taking a test, write down that acronym instead of that big thing, and just take your test and move the decimal point either to the left or to the right. And that concludes your lesson.